What's up, guys? So, let's go out here. Discuss AMC real quick. I'm gonna make this short and quick, okay? Before the after hours. I'm gonna try to get this uploaded before four o'clock, okay? So, I've said earlier this morning, I did say that I gave a price prediction where AMC is gonna go. And I've been telling people, I've been telling people, it's not financial advice, but it's just what I see. All week, last week, I said, come this week, thir Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, or Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, AMC, there's going to be a big um, sell-off coming. There's going to be a big down slide, all right? And we're here, right? A lot of people didn't believe what I was telling them. Of course, they, they're entitled to their opinion. It's just what I, what I see, what I've seen, and what I thought was going to happen. And so we're here. We're here at the 17. Now, this morning, I made a price prediction because I mentioned it again about um, this that we were going to be in this 17 area um, and the big sell-off that was coming for this week. And we're here, okay? Um, this morning, I made a video. You know what? Let's just go ahead, go to the video. I'm, I'm, I'll go ahead and play it. Okay. I do think we're going to see at least the mid-17s. After it runs up, when the market open up, you're going to see some, you probably see a big buy in order to come in. Amps is going to run up, it's going to come down. And don't be surprised if it closed around 17 today, okay? It's Friday, the market's going to move kind of slow. Let me get something to drink real quick. The market's going to move very slowly, but they may have something in store for us today because. They know a lot of people are not going to. Oh, this Frankie. I'm going to have to watch him. I watch him, guys. The guy up there, Frankie. Um, he's a good dude. Um, and I know he watched some of my videos, too. Um, what was I saying? Um, yeah, I do think we're going to see that mid-17 today. We're going to run up. The buying orders are going to come in, and it's going to look like we're running. And then they're going to take these profits. So what I'm going to do, um, I may... Okay, so that's enough of that. Let's go back to the AMC. Let me open this up. And we're here. We're here, like I said. This is something that I predicted last week. And I actually predicted, predicted this like two weeks ago. And I said that, that it was going to be a big sell-off. And the sell-off took place over, over some days and brought us back down. And we were at the, what, high 26, 27, almost 27. And now we're back down at 17. So we're here. And like I said, come Monday, Tuesday, possible Wednesday, that's where we're going to know where we stand after these ape shares are in the hands of people, okay? Then you're really going to see what it's going to do to the price. The price may stay the same for a while up until they just decide to, hey, I'm going to convert these shares over from ape to AMC. You know, AMCs, they're not trying to lose money. The owner of AMC, he's not trying to lose money. He needs to stay in the money. He's still in debt. Even though they're making money, they're still in debt. So, he's not in the business to lose money. He's trying to do what's best. He's trying to keep all his income, which is us, on his side. This does not mean that you go sell your shares because... It's not like he's trying to take advantage of us. He's just trying to run a business like everybody else. Everybody else would probably do the same too. You got to keep your customers happy and you got to still run a, a profitable business. So that's what he's doing. Okay. And he's trying to be really transparent, but he has to do what he has to do to keep the company, keep the company going and surviving. Um, and that's, in, that's including him selling some of his shares if he want moving some of his money and buying other assets buying property buying other businesses he's going to do that because he already knows after when this squeeze happens whenever this squeeze happens a lot of people are going to be gone a lot of people are going to be gone and he's going to be back amc is going to be back in the same position it was very close to bankruptcy very close if not in bankruptcy they're gonna be very close to it and he don't want to get back in that position okay so 
the longer they can draw this out, the better for the company, for AMC. But a lot of people like us, we're tired. And some people are really, some people are caving in and falling. <laughs> and they're giving up. But, you know, you do what you want to do. Everybody's entitled to do what they want to do. Some people don't want to lose money, so they're going to sell and, and keep their money. Some people want to wait and hold it out until it runs up. Um, of course, when it runs up, everybody wants their money. And once they, people take their money, AMC is pretty much done. So, and he knows that, okay? No one's in, no one is really your friend when it comes to the stock market. No one, because it's about money, okay? So, um, but we're here at, oh, okay, so here comes some buying pressure, right? They're trying to get this, like I said, back to um, 18 before closing, and that's what it's, yeah, that's what it's doing. And then, after hours, we're going to see what's going to happen. We're going to see. Um, anything else? I think that's it. I think that's all I wanted to talk about. It's about it looks like it's about the storm over here. And I'm going to get off of here and upload this. Try to get it uploaded before after hours so we can see what's going on. All right, guys. Take care. I may have another video later. Talk about some more things. But uh, see you next one. Enjoy your weekend. Peace. Take care.